Culture Warrior segment tonight. Canadian TV recently had a show called a Russell Peters Christmas Special. In that program, there was a satire on the birth of Jesus with Pamela Anderson playing the Virgin Mary. Word on the sun has it, the King Herod has put a hit out on the old baby. The old baby. Oh, well, we gotta get her out of here. Huh? The news is us. Jesus. Someone likes that name. <laughs> Hysterical. <laughs> now, today, December 8th, is the Feast of the Immaculate Conception, a holy day in the Roman Catholic Church. Joining us now from New York with reaction, the culture warriors, Gretchen Carlson and Margaret Hoover. So, Hoover! What say you? I, you're going to hate this, Bill, and it's, you'll probably say it because I'm not a Catholic. I'm Catholic light. I'm Episcopalian. But I actually thought this was funny. I, you know, we all can take a joke at the holidays, and this was meant to be irreverent. 2.1 million Canadians tuned in to watch Pamela and Anderson as the Virgin Mary, and we all get the joke. Clearly, Pamela Anderson is no Virgin Mary. That's the point. I didn't That's get the joke. That's the joke. So wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. You, you thought this was hysterical, funny? Uh, I thought it was good humor. I thought it was it was ironic humor. humor. It was funny. Take a joke. Come on, I, Bill. It's I, a light. It's well, the holiday. Well, well, listen to you. I haven't. I didn't think it was funny, but I'm not. You know, it, the whole thing was hysterical. Opinion. I watched Bill, a few clips. It was let me point out. Let me point out that two million viewers is is nothing. It is not a yeah, good rating. Yeah, that's what I'm just going you know, no, 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 Bill. Hockey night in Canada gets five times. Yeah. Now, okay, Thank goodness so. we don't live in Canada because we didn't have to be bored to tears with this over the top, ton in cheek <laughs> stupidity. You know why people? The only reason people were laughing at this bill was because there was a laugh track okay yes. oh. this was the stupidest thing i've ever seen as far as being offended from the religious aspect i'm not because the idea that pamela anderson for a second is a virgin is joke enough all right but you know it is there are people who are very religious and mary is an icon the mother of jesus is an icon and to have pamela anderson you know using little profane words under that banner it certainly pushes the good taste realm is it necessary i don't know i i just think it's sophomoric and uh Dumb. i'm not offended by it I, but nothing very fit little offends me anymore but i could see why people would be offended by it and uh, i'm you know i think it's just dopey all right now deck the halls with boughs of holly you, you guys want to sing that can you both sing it together sure. yeah. deck the halls with balls. all right enough ba -la -la -la. That's okay. <laughs> Sorry. let's have bing crosby pick all it right. up Go. Deck the halls with boughs of holly. Fa la 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 la. Tis the season to be jolly. Fa la 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 la. Don we now our gay apparel. Fa la 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 la. <laughs> uh oh, gay apparel in the Cherry Knoll Elementary School in Traverse City, Michigan. Gay apparel, out of there. Yep. Carl, uh, why? Well, for first and second graders, the music teacher decided last Friday that because the kids were giggling when they sang that line, that she would change it to bright apparel. Now, this only lasted a day because the principal got wind of it and immediately said that this was a personal decision by the teacher and they put it back to gay. But let me tell you something. This doesn't begin to top other things that I've heard happening at other schools. Like I told you a couple of weeks ago, my son coming home and singing, we wish you a happy holiday instead of we wish you a Merry Christmas. And he thought that that was the actual lyric to the song. Why, and, and, and the bigger point here is, why are they even singing Deck the Halls? Because it's a Christmas carol, but it doesn't say Jesus. So what's happened is since you can't say Jesus in any Christmas carols anymore, Teachers are digging in the bottom of the barrel for songs, and now they end up with this. All right. Well, technically, Deck the Halls is not a Christmas carol. It's a Christmas song. Christmas carols as close do as they can get. reference uh, the birth of Christ. Okay, now, Hoover, since uh, anything goes in your world, and you, you <laughs> oh, like right, everything. Right. I like um, that. That's good. That's good, Phil. Thanks. <laughs> thanks. I have no morals. I have no values. Gay, we Episcopalians. We don't, why, we don't think much Why would first graders be giggling at gay apparel? I mean, we don't use that term anymore, gay apparel. Well, um, but, well, as we all know, the term gay means happy, but also gay is a reference to people who are homosexuals. And the two does gay really second mean and first happy? and second, yeah. first and second, come on, Bill Old English, you're an educated guy. So the, the problem here to me is that you've got kids who are going to laugh at anything. I mean, if a guy's name is Richard, they're going to call him Dick and they're going to laugh and they're, they're going to think it's crazy <laughs> and they're going to point their fingers and they're going to make fun of kids, right? But the, the problem here is that if you're laughing at gay, what the teacher, in my view, should have done is probably said, hold on a sec, what are you doing laughing because somebody's gay? Because you know what? 
There are going to be people that are going to meet when they're gay. And then you're, when you begin laughing at people because they're yeah. different, that's how bullying begins. I don't know if it's that. They don't understand. Uh, but, I think you know, they know more I, than I we think you, they do. They may not I would understand like to the those. I would have liked to have interviewed those kids and say, why were you laughing at gay apparel? Yeah, they Wouldn't do it be know. fascinating, though, if we could just channel Art Link letter, kids say the craziest things, yeah. to say, why are you laughing at gay apparel? Why is that fine? I'd love to know what... I Why think they it's were because laughing. they know they that know. being gay is different. Right, and that's maybe. where you have to correct them and teach them how to be respectful but they don't of people even who are know different what... rather than make fun of people who are different. Ladies, because that's the beginning even... of bullying. They don't even know what apparel means. Correct. So, right, Come on. They don't. All right. But they do know what All right, means. a culture warriors, everybody.